Hello friends, today I will teach you about the relational or comparison operators or conditional logic operators. These are the same, just we have to know that how can we use them. So here relational operators are used to compare the value of operand expressions to produce logic value is either true or false. Just we will get the output in true or false. So see here, these are the operators, symbols. And here are usages of the these operators. So result false true false true. So let's see now by doing it on the code. So here first is less than. What is the mean by less than? If you see here, I have written five, and this is the less than mark two. So see here that five less than mark. So see here five less than. Two, no, it's false. So we will get the result false because five is greater than two. It's not uh, less than two. So that's why uh, we are getting a false output. If we talk about uh, this, that uh, uh, print five less than two, then I will get the output true. So see here. It's another example. There is a, a variable. I have initialized the 5 in A variable, 2 in B variable value. This is the third variable where I am going to store this expression in this variable. So a value equals to A less than B. It means that A5 and B2. So print value. So see here. False. Definitely uh, A is greater than b but here is written a is less than b so that's why i am getting a false so here greater than just like same uh, th this is the same code which we have done before here so just see here i will get the result through because 5 is greater than 2 and uh, this one a is equal to 5 b is equal to 2 this is the third variable where I am going to store this value in this variable. So now if I print it, it will be true, definitely. Because uh, A is greater than B. A has a 5 value, B has a 2. That's why A is greater than B. So less than or equal to. If you see here, first example, print 5 less than equals to 2. It means that 5 is less than or equal to 2. But 5 is less than and not equal to 2. That's why I am getting false. Because 5 is not less than 2. 5 is greater than 2. That's why I am getting a false condition. It's not a true condition. Another example. 5. Print 5 less than equal to 5. That's why definitely 5 is uh, not less than 5 but 5 is equals to 5 that's why I will get result true see here so if you don't understand then please let me know as I can clear your doubts so here uh, a is equal to 5 b is equal to 2 value is equal to a less than equal to b it means that a is 5 and b is 2 so a less than equals to b B. It means that it, it, this condition will be false because a 5 is not equal to 2 but 5 is less than 2 but 5 is not equal to 2. That's why I am getting a false value. Greater than or equal to here. If I run it, same condition. Uh, 5 is greater than equal to 2 but 5 is definitely greater, greater than 2 but 5 is not equal to 2. There is a one condition true, that's why I am getting true. So another example, this is also true. 5 is 5 is greater than or equal to 5. Definitely 5 is not a greater than 5, but 5 is equal to 5. That's why I am getting a true condition. See here, A is equal to 5 and B is equal to 2. Value is equal to A greater than equals to B. It means that A is definitely A is not uh, equal to B, but A is greater than B. So I will get the uh, output to you. 
see here equal to so here print b equal to equal to 2 it's not it means that 5 is not equal to equal to 2 that's why i will get the output false see here another example print print b equals to equals to 5 it means that 5 equals to equals to 5 it means true because 5 is equal to 5 I see here a is equal to 5 and b is equal to 2 value is equal to a is equal to b so definitely it will output false so just like these you have to practice step by step as can you understand more so if you have any question you can ask me there is a my number in description you can ask me directly not equal to this is a sign so we will use here 5 is not equal to 4 that's definitely it's it's a true condition 5 is not equal to 4 so output will be true 5 is not not equal to 5 it is a false because 5 is equal to 5 that's why I will get the false so see here if I talk about the a is equal to 5 and b is equal to 2 value a is not equal to b definitely a is not equal to b that's why I will get the output true see here so friends this was about the uh, logical operators relational operators and conditional operators that we were uh, using in this program so I hope so that you will understand the this uh, logical operators so if you have any question you can contact me through my phone phone number uh, and my email address these are the available in description just follow them thanks for watching